Why do we make small movements in Feldenkrais? Let's compare the process of forming the nervous system to a waterway. Pour a lot of water into the waterway. It becomes uncertain where the water passes and goes to. Splashes will fly and waterways will be used more widely and randomly. Now, let the water flow in very small amount. The waterway is limited and the same waterway is continued to be used. It will pass the same route even after stopping the water flow and restart. When large nerve stimulation is applied, it propagates to a wide range of muscles. But a small stimulation is limited to stimulation of a specific muscles. And when the stimulation is restarted after a while, it is likely to take the same path.